All right, so still in my car. So you're gonna turn the light on here. Uh, apparently, a, at least one buoy uh, picked up a 4.5 meter wave, which is pretty massive. Um, some models from Kodiak already out that don't uh, look so good that really might actually be hitting. Not just uh, a fake warning. Uh, it's kind of nuts. Something like this might actually be happening. Um, up here in Alaska, we had that bad earthquake uh, November 19. And when that happened, there was a tsunami alert as well when I was in Seward at the time. And uh, that one, there wasn't actually a tsunami that came through. It's kind of a, a false warning there, but uh, it sounds like this one might actually be happening. It's kind of sketch. So I was staying at the hotel, or one of the hotels right down, not on the Homer Spit, but uh, right by it, the Aspen Suites there. So uh, hopefully nothing major is going on and everything will be all right. Uh, you know, it's pretty selfish just to hope I can get my stuff back, but uh, man, I hope every, all the boats and stuff and everyone else is all right. This man, it's horrible. So we're just kind of waiting and seeing what happens now. Uh, the Alaska State Troopers have posted a couple troopers right here in front of the parking lot where I'm at. They're not preventing cars from going to Homer, but they're warning them all. They're stopping them. Got a couple of people, uh, or a trooper or two, standing in the highway, some of the stopping cars. And there's a lot of cars coming out uh, from Homer area. This little parking lot's completely full. It's the big overlook right as you're pulling down into Homer. And uh, it's just all full. So everyone just getting out of Dodge, basically. Um, there were a steady stream of headlights coming off of the strip, or the strip, the spit. So it seems like everyone's taking it seriously. Homer did fire off the tsunami sirens, but maybe only for 30 seconds or a minute. And where I was at, uh, I was listening to music in the hotel room, about ready to hop in the shower and go to bed. And there was a loud motor at like a maintenance shop or something next door, so I wasn't really sure that's what it was, but I talked to a couple other people and they were like, yeah, they fired off the sirens, but only for a little bit. So, kind of waiting and seeing for now, and uh, hopefully nothing happens. So, keep you guys updated.